beautiful people this is the lady I wanted to come in and share with you guys a new unit yes I am wearing her isn't she lovely she is 18 inches yakky texture um, a glueless cap full lace wig I purchased her from eBay the company is called I have their invoice let's see the company I purchased her from was Remy Queen Beauty off of eBay. I'll just cover up my address there. And there's the information. This is the site that I, um, or I uh, this is the company that I ordered from. As you can see, I paid uh, $200 for this unit. I wanted you guys to know I don't get my units for free, <laughs> okay? I have to pay for them too. And the wig cap look pretty close to the ones that I have. Uh, other than on this one, the lace in the front is the thick uh, hard lace. It is 0.12 hard lace, the kind of lace you find on synthetic wigs. And I purchased this because I thought with the hard lace, it will give me a lay down pretty close and flush to your skin without combs, without installing, uh, having to install bobby pins or anything like that. So I thought, okay, I will buy this one because it has the hard lace on it. I can not have to wear any tape or glue with this kind of unit. However, I was wrong. This unit I had to apply down with tape because the lace right here in the front, right here in the freaking front, <laughs> center of my head, the lace was puckering up a little bit. It wasn't laying flush on my skin. And I don't understand that. I don't know why. But it's now a pretty much a full lace wig that I had to apply with tape. Uh, one side, I believe it was this side here, went on without any hitch or any problems whatsoever, okay? So this side did really well. However, on this side, it doesn't look bad right now, but there are areas, there are areas on here that has a little bit of a bump to it because I had to kind of force the lace to lay down onto the tape. It was uh, it was almost like one side was longer than the other side. Even though the back of the unit is flush and straight to my nape area, the front was kind of like this, okay? So it, it was just a little bit weird. Um, but I managed it, okay? It's not something unmanageable. It's just you have to, it, it, it required me to do a little more than I normally would do to a glueless cap wig all right when it, when I first got it it shed it okay right out of the package I combed it it shed it when I co-washed it it did shed some hair I even followed their instructions on the back of their card and these are the instructions okay and this is the very first time that I saw uh, wig instructions that that recommend you not submerge the hair into water okay uh, this one said to uh, gently it said to when washing gradually wet the hair down and brush it gently before you completely wash the hair that's you know I normally I would you know, dip the hair in water uh, a couple of times and then I will submerge it. But I would be dipping the whole unit in the water, not just little portions of the hair uh, until it's completely wet. So this one actually said to, um, when washing it, you want to gradually wet the hair. Hopefully you guys can see that, all right? And um, it also said that, um, do not color, perm, or do any extra chemicals because it's already been treated. So they're telling me I can't color this hair, which is another con because 
I like coloring my hair and it's like okay if I color it what's gonna happen um, I guess the integrity of the knots and uh, all of that will be in play and I'll probably get even more shedding so um, another con I don't like about it um, could be a deal breaker for some people okay um, the positives now the positives as you guys can see the hairline is gorgeous it does have the wispy hairs that make it look more natural around the hairline um, the lace is um, a go again heart lace uh, which could be a positive or negative it's a positive because that's why I bought it. it it had the heart lace on it I've already doctored it up a little bit just applying a little bit of my foundation or excuse me my uh, concealer in the part to give it a natural look and um, of course I washed it it did not bleed or anything how long like it is it is pretty long okay I ordered an 18 inch and you guys can see the tangles all right it's you have to um, it's gonna call it's gonna take some upkeep on this one and um, like it like it said on the instructions you're gonna have to keep your your comb and brush handy with this one um, but it is pretty long I ordered 18 inches and as you guys can see it's surpassing 18 inches um, it is going past my breast area and so that's about 22 so that's about 22 to 24 inches in length okay and um, the hair is gorgeous I love it all right um, I love the density It's about a hundred to a hundred and ten percent in density um, but anyway other than that the unit is gorgeous okay other than those six <laughs> things that I listed as a con the hair is gorgeous it's beautiful yakky texture my favorite texture like in the whole world of wigs and it reminds me of my Chinese virgin yakky hair uh, it's um, just that but it's gorgeous hair I love it and so they did a really good job uh, the shipping of course they needed two days to process the order and it took two days for me to get it so a total of four four days uh, four business days before I got the unit I've shown you the uh, the hairline not bad I think very nice hairline like I said this side took took very well uh, I was able to get it to apply down really really well and I really like this side a lot better than I do on this side um, it took some work to get this side you know the way I like it and I'm pretty much a perfectionist when it comes to my lace wigs I want my wigs to look as natural and as realistic as possible okay I don't care I, that people know I wear wigs I do care that they can tell I wear wigs you know what I'm saying there's a difference there's a difference between someone knowing you wear a wig and someone just look at you and say that's a wig okay uh, see I, my wigs and or they see me and they see my hair they are searching okay they are searching my my hairline they are searching my roots they're searching my part trying to see if they can tell if it's a wig or not okay and that to me is the compliment um, that means I applied the unit properly and I have the right texture for my you know for my uh, my ethnicity and it looks real it looks like it's coming out of my scalp alright you guys so this is my look with um, a little bit of layering and um, just putting some big curls in it big girl curls just wanted to see how it will hold the curl please with that um, yeah long layers nothing short just something you know to kind of frame the face so that's it thanks for watching bye